and I am going to tell you about my morning routine today. I have the 10, 10, 10 rule that I follow. The first 10 minutes after I wake up, I go into a deep guided meditation. Then I go into reading and then I go into journaling. Pretty simple, but let's dive a little bit deeper into that process so that you understand exactly what I do and maybe I can inspire you to follow it and do something similar. So when I go into meditation, I like to wear my ear pods that are noise cancelling because sometimes there's just noise outside or just little noises in the house that distract me. So I like to put on my ear pods and I have tried often to meditate without any guidance, without any music, but it's really difficult for me, especially in the morning, because I'm still tired, so the music helps. And of course, having a guided meditation, having a guide in your ears is really, really helpful. I especially like Deepak Chopra these days, the seven spiritual laws of success helped me a lot. It's a combination of personal development and meditation. I really love that. Then I go into reading my favorite book. Uh, and uh, it's, I mean, I shouldn't say my favorite book. I basically have a reading list, a wish list, and it is super long, but I try to work on it and every day I read for at least 10 minutes. What I do is I really like to underline important parts, highlight important parts, and I do that either physically with a pen in a book or when I have the Kindle version, I highlight it virtually. Very often, what I read in the morning also helps me with my content on my LinkedIn profile throughout the day because typically I always read about personal development, professional development, um, learning some, something, financial development. It always has to do with improving myself. Next, I go into the journaling part and that is something that I have really been reluctant to doing because I don't know why, I can't tell you why, but I will tell you that it is very powerful. And I found a journaling method for me that is called the Oak Journal. And it's really neat because each day has a set of pages allocated to it. And then you have to basically think about your focus of the day, about the three most important tasks of the day, and also about how you want to organize your day. So that is very important. And then usually on the, that's on the left hand side and then on the right hand side, there is a question that requires some reflection and I can write down my thoughts. So yeah, that, those are my, that's my morning routine in a nutshell for you. And I'm very interested in uh, what yours is. Uh, do you have a morning routine? Uh, do you follow it? Does it work for you? And um, it seems to me like all the successful people nowadays have a morning routine. And um, yeah, so the other, thing is that I am so terribly busy in my life that I had to get up way earlier to make room for that morning routine and that would be 4 a.m. Yes, I get up at 4 a.m. and usually at 4.10 I start the meditation. Um, takes me 10 minutes to get up, get my first cup of coffee get settled on my couch and then start the meditation. So 4 a.m. is the time I like to get up. 